today to another episode of Edible Eric Eats. On today's episode, we're working with tuna. Specifically, specifically, we're gonna make some tuna poke. A very simple dish. We're gonna do a blackened tuna poke. So I have my tuna, it's already portioned, it's sushi grade. So we hit it with some salt and some pepper. Now we're gonna hit it with our house-made blackening spice. We've got our tuna nicely coated. Now, now we burn it. And I'm just doing this to put a little, to toast the spices a little bit. It's not to cook the fish in any way. All right, so we toasted those. We toasted this blackening spice. Now we're just gonna dice it up. And with poke, you want a larger dice. It shouldn't be so tiny. So you want about a medium dice. We got our tuna, nice and pink. In our bowl we have, along with our tuna, we put some diced red onion, some diced red pepper, some poblano, and something called grilled chayote. Well, it's something called chayote that we grilled first and diced up. So that's all in there. We're gonna add some scallion. And I'm okay with using the white part. So we're gonna do a little mix of each. A little bit of that goes in there. Then we're gonna hit it with uh, a little bit of thyme. Add that to it. Now, to this, we're gonna add some soy sauce, a little bit, some mirin, a little bit, and just a dash of sesame oil. Sesame oil is very strong. Always add a little bit. Always start with a little bit because you can always add more. I'm gonna add literally that much. We're gonna add it with some salt. Pepper. Toss it. Taste it. That's good. That fish is plump. It's moist. The toasted blackening comes through real nice. You get a little nuance of like garlic powder and like cumin, some cayenne. Then you get the umami from the soy sauce. Get a little sweet from the mirror. Man, that's good. So now we're gonna plate. Take our poke. Finish by adding a little bit of uh, fattiness, a little richness by adding a Szechuan chipotle aioli. So we're just gonna kind of dot this on the plate randomly, so you can mix it in as you eat it, and then we're gonna finish it with sesame seeds for a little textural contrast. So there you have it, guys. A tuna, a blackened tuna poke. Dig in, guys. You're gonna love this. Uh, super fresh, super clean, super tasty. Enjoy. Keep, uh, stay hungry and keep on eating. Hey, guys, looking for more? Looking to up your cooking skills? Then be sure to click subscribe so you can follow me while I break down techniques, dish out succulent tips, and show you a variety of recipes for you to learn from so you can not only keep on eating, but eat deliciously. Check out some of the other videos I got for you guys to watch.